Hey, how's it going? Just in downtown Tacoma. I'm on, uh, I think I'm on where St. Helens meets Market. <clears throat> now I'm going to come in here to the mix and probably have a rum and coke. right over there. The next place over is Puget Sound Pizza. They're very good. Well, at least they were a year ago. Beat the hell out of Spud's Pizza. Spud's Pizza uh, near 72nd and Pacific Avenue used to be the best pizza in in the whole area. It just used to be awesome, but they never replaced their equipment. They figured they could just keep getting by with what they had, and as it gets decayed, and man, the, 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 the seating is, uh, it's, it's a rundown place, and their oven is rundown, and crust is burnt in some spots and not cooked in others, and, uh, yeah, just not that great. So, <clears throat> and it's sad because it was a sort of an icon of Tacoma, you know. I want to make sure of something. I wanted to make sure the focus was right. From different ways, I was holding the. Uh, a little cheap steady cam thing while I was in the bar. Coming up is Club Silverstone. Hey, how's it going? Look at this guy. What are you filming? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Get me in there. Get me in there. You said okay for the first night, and then the next week. That is a bright light. Yep, I'm filming and shit, for sure. 
Oh, kind of sad to see some of these uh, for rent. Available now, commercial. Blabba shop. In a place that just for some reason has, uh, as you can see, the uh, This time I hear a hint of, no, not coming from there though. See, I hear a hint of uh, EDM, but. This here used to be, Used to be, at one point it was called Grounds for Coffee, and then the the people who owned the building uh, sold it to Tully's Coffee. People were really disappointed. Oh, this wasn't here when I was last here. This is a recent, uh, someone uh, broke the windows of the place. It's a weird uh, building here. And as you can see, it, it almost comes to a point. It's a very interesting building. I think it'd be cool as hell to have one of the uh, one of the apartments up there. I mean, that'd be fucking cool as hell. I'd love that. It'd just be awesome. But uh, yeah, here we go. I'll be back to that building soon in this video. Leroy Jewelers. Nice, they've got the water features actually working.
wondered about that uh, that stairway that leads down, and I can see that there's uh, yeah, there's a stairway leading down, but let me just show you what that's looking like. I don't want to bother anyone that's sleeping, so I will leave them alone. Kind of need to know that that stairway that uh, is that leads to Pacific is still there, though. But I'm glad this is Bostwick now and not a huge chain. Though it's really still a shame about Grounds for Coffee. It was a great place. Across the street used to be a uh, an adult bookstore. I, for some reason, can't remember the name of it though. Coming up is the other entrance. I guess you could call it the rear entrance to Club Silverstone. And, and dancing events and things like that. And uh, here is the, just the regular. It's a steady cam thing for my camera. It's uh, to keep it steady for uh, so I can walk around and, and it doesn't all bounce around. <laughs> Get to the restrooms. 
interesting place. Whoops. Have to go up in the air, but had to go up in the air of Russia. At the end of this street, there is a uh, antique shop that I used to know someone who, uh, who ran it. And here comes the truck coming really fast. Let's see if they stop by the time they get here. Yes, they do. So there are good places out here. Club Zilferstone used to charge two dollars for a bottle of water and you couldn't I mean you could have you could have gotten four drinks and then if you got a wanted water, nope sorry, two dollars for a bottle of water. Well now they've they've changed that. So anyway don't know what more to say. Have a good time.